Hello again, everyone. Yata, bienvenidos, and mabuhay. For this address, I'm going to take a break from boring updates about state legislation and instead focus more on some student success and achievement. But first, we do have a couple of updates. The first one is that our safety department is collaborating with MANT System Verbal Communications to ensure the safety of our students with special needs. The MANT system is a proven program that emphasizes the importance of building positive relationships, effective communication, and de-escalation strategies to prevent crisis situations from getting out of hand. Our safety department is committed to implementing this program to provide a safe and secure environment for our students. We believe this program will enhance our ability to address challenging situations, and we're confident that it will be an asset to our school community. This week, we opened the public track behind the administration building. A huge thank you to the operations department and contractors for renovating the new track to have recycled football turf and new solar lights. This has been requested from our frequent track users, and we're glad to have these lights installed for our public to feel more safe and enjoy a walk or a run during the morning or evening hours. We do have several other projects finishing up and we'll communicate more of these operations in the next few weeks. Now on to some student successes and achievements. At Newcomb Elementary School, these students have shown excellent attendance all year long. Lily Begay, Alondra Hostein, Kaiser Manuel, Baraka Nelson, Mathau Yazi, Malia Charlie, Graciana Allen, Taylor Begay, and Arlena Benali Bahi. Eva B. Stokely would like to recognize the following PACS leaders in the fifth grade, Jarius Begay, Arian Begay, Chevelle Hernandez, and Aleandro James. In the fourth grade, Tyron Rowe and Caden Claw. In the third grade, Jason Cambridge, Sierra Yazi, Elijah James, and Kawhi Rosenberg. In kindergarten, Nyla Husky and Brielle Rowe. In the Jonah Elementary, there were some ice station scores for February 2024 that were fantastic. The overall reading scores, in first grade we have Devin Yazi with a 96%, in second grade Logan Franklin with 95%, also in the second grade Maria Saga with 99%, and the fourth grade Melena Dale with 95%. As far as overall math scores, in kindergarten Maria Katniss Felis had 93% and Alilas Yazi 93%. In the third grade, Matteo Chico with 93%, Auburn Joe 97%, and Mauricio Eagletail 98%. Over to Newcomb Middle School. Newcomb Middle School had two students who are member, they do have two students who are members of the Unity Council that we need to recognize, Jamie Annalyn White and Jamie Sewell. At Kirtland Middle School, Kirtland Middle School competed at the State Science Olympiad. They medaled in nine events, and scored the highest of all the San Juan County schools. Curlin Middle School finished 11th overall at state. On to Sabatai. At Sabatai, the Warriors Olympiad team won the overall Spirit Award at the New Mexico State Olympiad competition. There were 24 school teams competing, and our team finished in the top 10. A special thank you to coaches Steve Salago, Utana Danetkla, Riza Morial, and Amy John. We did have a first place winner, Ariel Scrambled by Monique Pierce and Miss TBA, Adelina Begay. And we had a second place, Solar Power by Timothy Yazzie. And at Newcomb High School, a shout out to Shayla Howe for representing Newcomb at the New Mexico State Wrestling Competition. Newcomb High has a leadership class that's been doing a great job with sponsoring events and activities for their school and also being spokesperson for the 120th day count. Lionel Dez, Michaela Roanhorse, and Relindria Foster should all be recognized for that. Over to Shiprock High School, Tanisha Dick won 7th place overall in the FFA Livestock Judging in Carrizo and qualified for state competition with her Livestock Judging team. The FFA Vet Science, Horticulture, and Food Science teams all qualified for the state competition. And in basketball, Navon Begay broke 1,000 points for his high school career. Over at Kirtland Central High School, Noah Dinyazi, he's a basketball player, he's got good grades, he's a leader, and he pays it forward. Good job, Noah. 
Gabriel Jake is a skateboarder who consistently displays helpfulness, politeness, and a strong work ethic in the classroom. Justin Harrison won gold at the recent BPA competition. Matter of fact, Kirtland Central High School received five first place awards and scholarships from BPA. Over at Mon Wilson, they've been nominated for the National Technical Honor Society, the NTHS, at the Bon Wilson Technical Center. They're the only National Technical Honor Society chapter in San Juan County. Honor students include the following students. In construction, Justin Charles, Bradley Franco, and Xavier Horsechief. In health sciences, Michaela Jim, Gabriela Begay, and Tanya Manuelito. In welding, Joseph Silva and Elijah So. In IT, Calvin Barber and Amy Begay. Congratulations to those students. Now onto our weekly sports updates. Congratulations to all of our winter sports teams as we're closing up wrestling and basketball. But we do have some district and state basketball games remaining. Last night, the Kirtland Broncos suffered a tough loss to a strong Gallup team, and the Shiprock Chieftains were upset by a scrappy Bloomfield team. Both teams represented us well in the district tournament. Great job, boys. In ladies basketball, Kirtland has an automatic bid into the state playoffs with the tiebreaker win they had last week over Gallup. However, the Lady Broncos will face off again tonight with Gallup for the fourth time this year for the district championship. Let's go Lady Broncos. This Sunday, we're looking forward to seeing the state playoff brackets because all schools have an opportunity to make it into the top 15 spots in 3A and 4A classifications. Good luck to all of our teams, and thank you for always competing with class. And that's all I have for today. See you next time. Hagone. Adios. Palam.